Hey guys, welcome back. So in this video, we will see how to handle pop-up windows which sometimes get appear on few of the web pages. And these are the pop-up window which sometimes can even appear if we click on some links. This pop-up window can come sometime in front of our window, the main window, or maybe in the form of a tab. For example, if you see, if I click on this link, visit Google, then it will open up in tab and visit Yahoo open up in tab if I click on this button child window it will open up in some window okay so that is a complete window I mean to say it has a mini minimize maximize and close window just like that in tab also we have a minimize and close window all right so we will see how to handle it with our code so this is few of the lines of the code which I have already written which are very common for and we have seen that into our other tutorial also that we have to set the system properties first we have to inst instantiate driver we have to open the page through driver.cat and I'm maximizing a window after that I am clicking on these two link Google and Yahoo by passing driver.find element and passing xpath in that and then doing a dot click and we have seen that in previous videos also it is very easy to do that okay now what we have to do once it's it is clicked by a program okay let's say our requirement is we have to print the title on these two tabs okay and after printing the title we have to close these two tabs and we have to go back to our parent window so let's see how we can do that so in selenium we have a command called driver dot get window handle so I will give that command here so it is driver dot get window handle okay so it will return me in the string so I will type string parent equal to driver dot get window handle or maybe I can say parent handle let's make this small so what this command will do it will get the ID of my this page, a window ID of this page and store it in a form of a string onto this, into this variable. I will let you know why we are doing that and why we are storing that. Okay. So one command is driver.getWindowHandle. Another command is driver.getWindowHandle with the S at the end. So it would be driver.getWindowHandles. All right. And it will also get stored in a set of string okay let me call this as all window handle okay so this command will give me the handles of all these window which are open all these tabs which are open and it will store that into all window handle as a set okay so what I can do now I can just give a for loop here for and I will use the enhanced for loop so that I can traverse on each and every handle so I can give here string current handle and here I can give all window handles so in each loop from each loop we will get a one handle and that will store that into this current handle okay if you want we can print that out also system dot out dot print ln okay and I can give here current window handle is double quote here and I can give current window handle here okay so I'm printing the current window handle so what this all window handle will include it will handle of these two tabs and it will also handle this parent window but we don't want to do anything with parent window right now because we already have a handle of that through a different command so we have to ignore our parent window and for that I will give if 
and under that I will give a command not and I can give this current window handle okay equals ignore case and I will give here parent handle So if I give this like not current handle dot equal ignore case parent handle so that's mean in case if they are equal don't do anything because in the else part I have not given anything if they are not equal then what they have to do first we have to switch to that handle so for that I can give driver dot switch to dot window okay and here I can give my handle name. So I can give this current handle name. Let me remove this not. Okay, so what will happen from this command and through this loop? So we will enter this, this loop with our three window handles. So first it has the first handle of a parent. So this command will print it out. And now this command if will check if it is a parent window and first time it will be a parent window so it will ignore that and in the second time it will come so it will not be equal to parent window so that's mean that would be a child window so what we are doing right now we are switching to a child window and now whatever command we could type with the driver command will happen in the child window okay if I want to print the title I just give sys out of that system dot out dot print ln and then I can give title of child window is okay and here I can give driver dot get title all right I am printing the title and once the title has been print I want to close that child window Okay, so this way my child window get closed all right only child window will close nothing will happen to the parent window okay so once everything is done my if loop is ended my for loop is ended I am here I want to close the parent window so for that I need to switch to my parent window again so that will be driver dot switch to dot window and in that I can give my parent window handle So here I can give my parent window handle. So once I switch to my parent window handle, I can close that main window also if I want. So this is a very small program if you see from here to here in which we can handle our complete window. Okay, so let me run that. So it has opened the window, it has opened the first link, it will open the second link now and it will verify, print the title, close it, close it. Okay, so if you see the program, in the console it says, first it has printed this which is for the parents so it has not done anything with that, then it has printed this and we have switched to that and we have printed the title as Yahoo. And then again we have we have a child window handle we have switched to that it has printed Google and then program finish and closing the main browser okay so we can see it again one more time first we have clicked on both the links after that we have get the parent window handle through get window handle and we have stored into parent handle after that we have tried driver dot get window handle with the s which will give me all the handles all right and we this is stored in a set and which type has a string and then with the enhanced for loop because it has now three IDs three window handle with the each loop that window handle will go to this current window handle 
we have printed that then we have check if it is equal to parent or not if it's equal to parent it will not do anything and uh, if it is not equal to parent that means it is child we are switching to that we are printing its title and we are closing driver instance of that so once this loop get over we are switching to the parent window again and then we are closing the browser so these kinds of window you will always get when you are trying to automate your project website sometimes these where these websites or uh, these uh, small window will appear in form of a tab or maybe in a pop-up box like in a knockery.com if you see because here also we get certain pop-up for the advertisements and in order to close that out you have to handle it through the same code which we have written through driver.close but yes you have to iterate it through the set and there are different ways through which we can iterate to that we can convert this set into the array list also all right we can use the iterator method also to you know iterate through all the sets so that is another that will i will show you another video but for now we are iterating through that enhanced for loop and we are doing an operation on those window all right so that's it for now for this video thank you